Hello and welcome fellow gamers to another episode of Timber and Stone. This is the second episode. This is my attempt to something different. Uh, the Minecraftish, uh, square-like uh, strategy game um, based on uh, set in uh, medieval medieval fantasy times, something like that. In the last episode, we've managed to uh, start our new settlement, and we. Uh, have managed to set up some farms and um, some basic tools and we started mining uh, ores. We have set up few uh, few uh, jobs to be done uh, with our a bunch of settl settlers. Unfortunately, as soon as I have started the game, I have noticed that the game stopped and a wolf has been spotted by uh, Nicole, uh, the wolf is a ba uh, yeah, uh, he, he's a bad boy. And what we need to do now is to set up, set up a guy who is gonna kill this wolf. And the guy is am I blind? Not wood chopper infantry. Yep. So we need infantry guy and the forager forager went out into the wild i don't ha i don't know how he managed to uh go over the lake because the plan was to the plan was to to stay safe over here, but apparently the wolves came out of this border, so that sucks. And now we need some other guys to defend um, to defend our village. Unfortunately, uh, most of the guys suck at the beginning. But we shall see how they will do against this wolf. So the wolf is somewhere over here. Uh, 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 I don't know what to do. Um, there is a stay idle, combat training, damage sick, charged enemies. So let's seek charge enemies. Pe -pe 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 -pe. Do not purse. Now just seek. No, no. You can do that. Seek. So we have a bunch of infantry guys. So let's see how this will work out. So he's over here. Charge this enemy. Charge this enemy. All of you kill him. Yes, smack his face. Smack his face. On the other hand, you have nothing. <laughs> you have no weapon, so that sucks. Kill him. Smack his ass. So that's cool. Yep. Yeah. Hey, we have managed to kill a wolf. So that's good. So let's let's pause the 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 game. And all of you can go back to your works. So I believe those were miners. Um, he uh, was a blacksmith or farmer. Let's set you as a farmer. And the archer, we need a bow and we need some arrows to be crafted. So let's set him up as a builder, because I believe I had a builder. So that's nice. And there is a forager over here, and we need him to go right over here to gather resources from this guy. And who are you? What, what, what do you do? You are a builder, and you have nothing to do. So that sucks. But hey ho, what can you do? Nothing. 
Okay, so the forager, forager came back from the wilderness. So let's set him over here. He will gather, gather some pelts, and the pelts are needed to uh, to create a bed. So now we can construct a bed, as well as we need some tools and food uh, stacks to be made. What's this? This is the stone anvil. So let's uh, construct. Let's construct objects and storage and tools I believe yes we need some tool chest we need a tool chest and let's place it just in the middle of um, in the middle of a town this is done by carpenter I believe and he's gonna need some some uh, process materials which is timber and we need some timber so we're gonna maintain in storage like 12 and for that we need carpenter and carpenter yes we do have uh, set up so the next order of business is uh, storage of food so let's make food crate yeah food crate so this is gonna be the place where all the settlers will get some food and the forager, the forager, where is our forager? Let's close those and let's see. He has some anil, animal fur, so let's get him over here to bring all the stuff over here so I can, so we can uh, create. What do we need to create? We need to create um, objects sleeping bed sleeping bed yeah that's that's nice huh <laughs> uh, workshops blah, blah 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 no deco no that's not the deco farms consumption military no that's not cut positions to the hole we need to set up a hole that's for sure and some roads as well so as you can see the guys can swim over the the rivers so that actually sucks because I saw in a few videos that you can be attacked by uh, by skeletons and we don't want that but for now we need to workshop no we need bed furniture yes straw bed so the straw bed is the basic bed where your people will sleep in and is it a farmer? I think so. Uh, and they will regain health by sleeping in a bed. As you can see over here there is a health and when they sleep in a bed they will regain health for example after the combat if they got wounded. So who are you mister? Let's check you out. So you are a builder. We don't you as a builder because the builder doesn't do anything. So let's set you up as a farmer, just for now, or a miner. No, I don't want second miner, but this miner. Ah, and we need some masonry uh, storage as well. I hope this won't get too dark for you because now it, now we have a night time. Um, let me know in a comment section down below if that's too. Uh, too dark for you. Uh, if so, I will set up some campfires um, to improve the lightning. So let's make the masonry uh, storage. It's gonna be somewhere over here. Or here, yeah. I don't want to. I don't want to make the settlement too big, and I don't want the guys to go over from here to here and from here to there and you know to produce stuff because uh, traveling traveling the long distance uh, traveling the dust the long distances uh, will lower the effectiveness of of my guys so that's cool uh, do we have the, the the bed set up no we don't we need some wheat, we have some wheat and we need some animal hide 
Where is this dumb guy? Is there any any way to call him over to the base and tell him leave the stuff at the base? Oh man, that sucks. Okay, so and uh, and what about the wolf? I don't know if the wolf has been fully gathered, but that's no biggie. Anyways, we have um we have set up a farm that's the flax farm and the farmers are working on it and we have a carrot farm so the amount of food is going uh, slowly but surely surely is going up and i think we should we should uh, f get some information about the dirt which is available to ra to us as well as a wheat because that's pretty important I believe mm, the barn is now level 4 farmer that's good we need some copper ore to be tracked tin or iron ore that's good and let's track as well timber twine and rope bricks bricks we're not gonna be making bricks but we do have some cloth some leather we need to track the standard ingots solid ingots and strong ingots as well and hand tools are crafted so we're gonna need some weapons that's for sure let's maintain in stock like eight because I think one two three four five six seven eight that's the number of the people we have in our settlement so they can fight um, those those guys we have a short bow and now we're gonna need a stone arrow we have 16 so let's maintain in storage like 20 we're gonna need feathers for that and feathers uh, we don't have materials to craft just a show bed, don't we? I thought we had some. The ore is beyond my skill level. Oh crap, the, the, the guys are, aren't do much. Uh, so let's pause it and let's set up. Let's dig this out. Let's level this. And we're gonna start working on our underground mine okay so let's set up let's um oh no that not that okay so let's uh, dig this out let's dig this out as well just the one block and the one block up here as well so that's cool that's gonna be the design for the new mine oh look we have a straw bed ownership available to anyone assigned to profession owned by settlers so that's cool so we can uh, we can set up a uh, settlement settler and just a single settler uh, to sleep in here but now we don't have any any uh, homes or stuff like that where we could place where we could place the beds designed to uh, each guys and let's see what they are doing he's the stonemason and he's producing some stuff so let's go over each and every guy what are you doing the forager is doing something and the farmer is farming of course uh, the wood chopper is chopping uh, he, the mine, and the second mine, and the ore, the ore is beyond my skill. Okay, so let's go with the mine underneath, under the ground. So let's select the dig, and we're gonna order them to dig this out, and this section, if you press down uh, arrow, we're going down, like one, and we're gonna go like so okay so now if we're gonna 
press the page down button not constantly but hitting the, the page down we will go through the ground as you can see and over here we're going underground so this is setup this setup is um, to dig out this area uh, one block beneath the level the base level of um, of the ground so that's cool let's bring those and this level up and let's unpause the video so that's cool now we have mine set up pretty much we can uh, order them to dig those out as soon as they uh, reach uh, high enough levels so that's cool this is going slowly but surely forward so what do you do guy you're a stonemason so why won't you um, the stonemason doesn't do much so let's set you up as a tailor for now does the tailor has anything to do? no we could set him up as a forager or a blacksmith the blacksmith but we have a blacksmith over here so we won't do that ok guys sorry about that unfortunately my game crashed and I had to uh, uh, redo and if uh, everything which uh, I have done we have done uh, so the last thing we wanted to do is um, is to do something with the guys who are idle and this guy over here uh, he's not doing much and he's a stonemason uh, so we need wood so le first let's uh, create the storage and the wood storage and the wood pile timber raw wood stack so let's place a raw wood stack close to the timber section and now what we can do is because the stonemason does nothing has nothing uh, interesting to do so let's set him up to produce some bricks the bricks are gonna be needed to uh, to do what? to uh, make some walls around our, our settlement and he said that he doesn't have a workshop and the workshop was the stone forge no stone forge need fuels so let's uh, fuel it up with the wood so that's gonna be that's gonna be cool and the next thing which we will focus on is the underground mine so let's go down below the uh, level of ground I'm hitting the page down so this is gonna be our underground mine so let's go something like that arrow up and that's that's gonna be the mine which they can dig out so that's cool okay so now everybody is doing something we're getting some food we have a quite nice amount of food so that's good and the, the mine is going great we have a straw bed where we can regain our health the health of the guys the uh, the carpenter is doing I believe he's making weapons clubs yes because the guys the um, the infant infantry men will need some will need some weapons some basic weapons and yeah that's going cool that's going really really well so okay we fought the first wolf today we killed it fortunately we didn't lose any guy we have start up 
started the uh, or the underground mine so that's even cooler no go up uh, we built the first bed and in the future we will need to set up a livestock pen we need to set up a hole but that's gonna be done in the next episode uh, so we're gonna wrap it up over here so if you like the video hit the like button down below leave a comment on any topic uh, which which you will choose uh, give me some advice on the game how to play it and what to do uh, next and yeah that's gonna be it so thanks for watching and i hope i see you guys in the next episode so take care then bye bye now this was borek logging off